Welcome for those of you in the Women of Elevation group on Facebook. And for those of you who are on Spreaker and iHeartRadio, as well as the Leadership TKO Station, uh, dot com, and even you might even be at womenofelevation.com's website. Listen, I welcome you to the Revitalized the Total Woman podcast. I'm your host, Lakeisha McKnight, your senior coach, and uh, just glad to be here with you all. You know, this podcast show, it's a media outlet connected to the nonprofit entitled Women of Elevation Career Services International. And so we do this podcast every Tuesday and Wednesday around 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And so listen, I'm glad to be here before each and every one of you guys, whether you're catching it live or the replay. Thank you so much for tuning in. For those of you who are beyond the USA and you're listening in by way of iHeartRadio and Spreaker and other places, you know, it really helps to give you information about the organization, what we intend to do and how we desire to help you. All right. The ways in which we fill in the gaps. And so we welcome you here to this podcast show. Now, as we've been giving the reminder, the name of the podcast show will be changing to be in alignment with the name of the organization. So as of January 1st of 2021, the podcast show will be Women of Elevation Empowerment Podcast. Okay. That's going to be the name of the podcast starting January the 1st of 2021. And so just to transition and remind you, we are in the final quarter of this year, 2020. And also, we have transitioned into the third core area that we address with the nonprofit. And so if you're not aware of the mission of the nonprofit, our mission is to truly empower women with the tools, you know, the tools to be able to create, relate, and elevate So you can walk in your God-given purpose and truly live your dream lifestyle. That is what this show is all about. And so we welcome you here and tuning in. Now, we have provided a little bit of an introduction to this core area, and we delved into part one. Now we're into part two tonight. And so part two really is a continuation from last night. And so what we really went over last night, we were talking about a couple of ways to truly enhance, elevate your mindset, because that's the focus for the month of September is really helping you to elevate your mind. And so just to lightly review what we've gone over last night, we talked about the importance of the fact that you are not your thoughts. Secondly, we said that thoughts are not reality. And third, we said You need to think what you have instead of what you lack. What you have instead of what you lack. Now, I do want to just give you about two additional points tonight, just to, we'll have more content to share with you on next week. Let me just look at my uh, handy dandy calendar right here so I can look at my time. And yeah, you know, we'll definitely be able to share with you some more great content next week. And I'm also going to give you a reminder about the upcoming events. Okay. So. What I want to continue with on tonight is to let you know it's important for you to look for opportunities. That's point number four. Look for opportunities. So what you look for, you will see. That's the point that I really want to make. What you look for, you will see. You will see that. And so please note, so if you look if you look for problems, you will see problems. But if you look for opportunities, you will find them and it will show you possibilities. Again, if you look for opportunities, you will find them and it will show you possibilities. So I just wanted to give you a heads up about that. Now, here's the fifth point that I really want to emphasize on tonight. And that is do not react on thoughts. Do not react on thoughts. You know, just like reacting on your emotions often creates negative outcome. Reacting on your thoughts can do the same. So really observe your thoughts and choose the ones that benefit you. Observe your thoughts and choose the ones that benefit you. So in summary, I just want to go again, 
remember those three points I reviewed at the very beginning? And I'm so, so, so once again, grateful for, you know, information that is gleaned. I mean, the re- the internet is, is full of resources, you know, Life Coach Code and other places online. I mean, it, it's never really the point of reinventing the wheel because we had the information right in front of us. So remember everyone, when it comes to really enhancing your thoughts and your mindset, elevating your mindset, you want to look for opportunities. You want to avoid reacting on thoughts. You want to think what you have instead of what you lack. You know, understand that thoughts are not reality and you are not your thoughts. Now, next week, we may come with just a couple of strategies, tips on what you can do every, you know, I don't want to say every day, but you can implement it every day to improve your mindset. I'm going to give you some more tips on how to do it. So come on back by. All right, this podcast show, we're going to be streaming it live right in the Women of Elevation group on Facebook, and we will be on the podcast platforms. So again, thank you so much. And remember, guys, we are preparing for our fourth annual Triumphant Women's Award celebration. We're gearing up for it. We're making sure our nominees are ready. And uh, we're just excited. And so we want to indefinitely extend the invitation out to you to check it out, to be present with us virtually. It will be a virtual celebration. And so we encourage you definitely learn more about this celebration, register to be a part of the celebration by visiting www.elevate-live.com. Again, that's elevate-live.com. For those of you on Facebook, you'll probably see a lot of information pertaining to that. We're going to definitely make sure our website is updated. You might not see it there just yet, but it will be updated within the next 24 hours. But you can go and register at elevate-live.com. So listen, I appreciate each and every one of you out there for plugging in, whether live or to the replay, to this podcast show. I'll be back next week with some more fresh content for you. So again, thank you so much, everyone. Be blessed and have a great rest of your week.